everybody, Matt DiCarlo here. I am the restaging director for Beetlejuice in Seoul, South Korea. I uh, cannot believe that after a year uh, plus of not working on a show, not being in a theater, not being in a rehearsal studio, that I'm headed across the globe uh, to recreate one of my favorite projects uh, I've ever worked on. I, um, I was the production stage manager of Beetlejuice for its Broadway run. Uh, this time I'm going to restage the show from the director's chair. I'm super glad that you're all coming on this ride with me. And uh, I have to get ready to go to the airport. Hey there, it is, uh, it's my first full day in quarantine here in Seoul. Yesterday's travel day was uh, wild. It was so long. Uh, the flight was great though. Uh, Connor Gallagher and I were the only two people in the business class cabin on our flight. So it was uh, nice and easy, had a lot of good food, watched some movies, uh, had some wine. And then when we got to the airport, uh, we had a whole ton of safety checks and uh, health checks to go through, had our temperature taken, had to fill out a ton of forms, went through customs. Then we got on a bus. The ride was like an hour long to get us to where we are. We're actually quarantining like an hour outside Seoul. So uh, we are here. We are um, in rooms that we can't leave uh, for the next 14 days. Connor's in the room right next door. Uh, we can like barely see each other when we reach out uh, the windows. Uh, luckily, our window's open. We have a great view. I'll have to do a tour of this room at some point uh, soon because uh, I moved around a lot of the furniture to make sure that I had some room. Um, what else? They drop off food three times a day. I brought a lot of snacks in my suitcase. And uh, we start rehearsal in two weeks, which is super exciting. But for the next 14 days, I am uh, here in this room. Uh, speaking of that, if you have any questions um, about anything you want me to answer while I'm doing this vlog, if there's anything you want to see, find me uh, on Instagram or Twitter, MaddieD0804. Um, I'm going to be documenting this whole process. So, uh, let me know what you're interested in and um, I'll do my best. Okay, room tour, starting with the mask I keep on the back of the door for when I have to get my food. Uh, then you open the door, there's a bathroom right when you walk in. Uh, it also doubles as a uh, kitchen sink, so there's that. Then there's like a little area where I keep all my food and my snacks. There's a little fridge down there um, between the stuff that came from the producers and what I brought from home. Um, I am stocked. There's no closet, so there's a little area to hang your clothes. And then you're into uh, the room. Here it is. That's uh, the bed. Uh, there was another smaller bed in here that I turned on its side uh, that I use as a shelf now um, so that I have some room on the floor to uh, do workouts and walk around a bit. There's a TV. Uh, I turned the desk against the window so that I can look outside while I'm working. Uh, made the side table out of a luggage rack and a box. And then there's a little table uh, and chair over here that I eat all of my meals at. And uh, that's it. That's the room. Okay, here are some facts about Beetlejuice here in Korea. Uh, the entire show is being translated into Korean. The script, the score, everything. Uh, there's a translator who's working with the authors and the creative team to do that translation. But the whole show will be performed completely in Korean by Korean performers. Uh, speaking of the cast, there are often multiple people who will play the roles during uh, the run here in Seoul. To Beetlejuice's, to Lydia's, to Adam's, to Barbara's, to Delia's, etc., etc., uh, I, I'm told the casting will be announced at some point in the next several weeks, so be on the lookout for that. Uh, the show is playing a 3,000-seat 
theater here in Korea. It's the Sejong Center. That's the venue that the show is doing its first run in this summer. And it's a um, replica of the Broadway show. So it'll have the same set design, same costume design, same lighting design, video design, sound design, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. Uh, it will look and feel uh, very much like the Broadway show, but will be done completely in Korean. Another day in quarantine. Here we are. Um, let's see. Got a uh, got a care package today from our producers. Uh, they sent us some stuff that we needed and also a whole bunch of snacks. Um, we got these uh, chips that sort of look like sun chips, um, but the flavor is garlic baguette and they taste just like they sound. Um, they're really good. Um, we, we got a whole bunch of snacks and stuff from them too. Um, we can't have any sort of food delivery here, but we're allowed to get packages. And the packages we found out just get dropped off right outside our door when they deliver one of our meals. Uh, so maybe I'll get some more packages delivered. Who knows? Uh, what else is going on? We have a production meeting with the U.S. team uh, who's uh, working on the show. Most of the uh, designers and uh technical staff coming over are joining us a little bit later. So we have a meeting with them tonight on Zoom. It's happening at 10 p.m. here in Korea so that it can happen in the morning in the States. Uh, that's how we sort of do all these meetings. And we've been doing it that way for months. They happen in either the morning or evening in Korea and vice versa at home. So um, I'm excited and looking forward to that. Um, yeah, just another exciting day in this hotel room that I can't leave. Um, I'm going to go do some work on the show. I'm going to uh, review uh, some of the scene work and some of the staging. And I'm trying to do a little of that every day. And um, also Zooming and FaceTiming during the day with Connor and Chris, who are in their rooms quarantining. So um, yeah, that's sort of it today. Not too much going on. <laughs> Something uh, big on my quarantine to-do list is to learn some uh, phrases and words for when I get out of here. So I'm uh, ready to hit the streets. Yes. Is this it? Yes. This is it. We're connected. Across the globe. It's amazing to me that it works that fast. That I know. And that, that we can talk to each other like this. I know. How is it? I mean, it's it's fine. It's, you know, it's quarantine. It's it's a little crazy. Uh, Connor's in the room literally next door, but we can't see each other. So it's so strange. It's it's weird. Right Where's here, Kevin? Right here. Oh. Hi, Kevin. Look how cute he is. Oh, celeb. That's him saying hi. He just, yeah. He's like, he's so tired of being a celebrity. He's like, it's been a long day and I don't Zoom after 10. Yeah, and he got groomed. And he's also, I do want to have you Zoom to meet the Korean Beetlejuices. Yes. I mean, it'll be I so wanna, fun. I want to meet, I want to meet... I want to meet them so bad because it's double cast, right? You said. Yeah. Yes. Um, give Jenny my love. Yes. Give every. Well, no one's there, but give <laughs> give no, give give yourself my love and knock knock on the wall four times for Connor. He'll know what it means. And uh, I miss you and I love you and I hope that you're well. Miss you and love you too. I'll talk to you soon. Bye, Maddie. Bye. All right, we have a one week down. One week in quarantine to go. One week till we start rehearsal. I hope I don't go crazy in this room. See you next week. It's showtime.